Good morning, good morning. This is Coach David Halal. Um, today I want to do a, a few supplement uh, review or actually or tell you about um, a few um, supplements that can help you. The first one I'm gonna start with is a supplement, uh, really, it's uh, it's not well known. A lot of people don't talk about it. Um, it is called boron, B-O-R-O-N. Don't worry, boron will not turn you into a moron. And it's not gonna make you boring either. <laughs> anyway, that was my joke for today. Uh, boron is very, very, very important. Um, uh, boron increase free testosterone and it's 100% natural it's in the earth uh, but of course because of how they raise food now you know the farm uh, you know uh, food the way they uh, grow food now it's not we don't get it straight from the soil anymore you know so it's it's in very small quantity um, so boron is extremely important. Now let me start uh, by uh, giving you the story, by telling you the story. In uh, 1998, and I remember, in 1998, I was at the gym working out. And as I'm at the gym working out, right? Working out and um, we were almost done, almost done. And, but at that time I was 23 years old. So I finished working out with all my friends. There was a lot of guys there that were more muscular than me, than, than I was, or than I, you know, uh, than, than I was. And uh, we were all done, and everybody went to drink water or drink their ghetto raids because I was in the late 90s. I, I was young, I didn't, I wasn't, you know, um, a lot of things were not available, you know what I'm saying? So like supplements and stuff like that, that I knew of. You know, because back then I had been in in this country for about four years. So after we finished working out, um, the guy, one of the guys that I was working out with, his name was Keith. He was doing um, his last set of uh, a, a bench press with uh, uh, 155 pounds. So he had the bar. He had 230. I mean, two uh, 45s. And he had ten another dime, you know, two two ten pounds, you know, and, and so it was 155 pounds. After he finished, so of course we all got up and everybody was drinking water and whatever. And I went to the bar to, to, to the restroom to pee. And when I came back, I grabbed the weight that he was doing biceps with. I mean, uh, tr um, that he was doing his chest with. And I did my biceps with it i did three sets of tens with 155 pounds now mind you i was way smaller i was 180 pounds i'm six feet tall now i'm oh you know 230 but i was 100 and um you know um 80 pounds 23 years old almost 24 and um you know i was able to do three sets of 10 with 155 pounds and everybody who was at the gym because i was so small and not only that, but all burnt out from working out because we're all doing upper body, biceps, triceps, uh, uh, back and chest. You know, that's how we did it. We did all the upper bodies and then we wait. We take one day off and then we'll do the next day. We'll do our lower bodies, you know, legs, calves and this and that, you know. Everybody was surprised. They were like, oh, my God, how did you do that? Where did you get the strength? So this guy, Keith, was doing the biceps and he was very ripped. He was smaller than me. In weight but he was a, a, a professional lightweight bodybuilder you know and he owns the gym right there in um, Hollywood Boulevard in 441 he said you you went to the bathroom and you took something didn't you I was looking at him I said yeah I drank water and I peed you know he's like no you took something we were all just laughing but he was serious taking that I took something because that's the only way I could be you know so strong you know after being I wasn't even able to finish my last set but as I get older if I try to do that 
you know, actually it probably was the only time I really did that. But after, as I get older, now that I'm 41 years old, I can't do that anymore. You know, yes, I can, if I start working out, you know, when I'm fresh and, you know, I've not been burned out yet, I can lift, you know, pretty good amount of weight. But once I get, once I'm done, it takes me a long time to recover. It took me a long time to recover, I should say. Until I get this thing here, Boron, B-O-R-O-N. My friends, this thing has been working wonders. I've been, I've been taking it, and uh, and also I've taken so, you know some other stuff. You see, you, you've seen them on my YouTube channel. But once I started taking Boron, my testosterone level shoots through the roof. My testosterone level shot through the roof. I became so strong. And I can tell, not only I'm strong, but uh, um, in, uh, when I'm working out, but, but I can see, you know, because testosterone is needed for, uh, for uh, 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 in men and female, you know, but in a man, when his testosterone is decreasing, he start being um, less masculine, if you know what I mean, you know? No, you, you understand what I'm saying? So, so, so once I started taking boron, not only I feel strong, but I feel very manly, you know? Like one of my shows in, uh, you know, Spartacus, you know, when uh, Badiatis was gonna take these guys to the, uh, you know, to, 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 uh, to kill somebody, and they started freaking out because one of the gladiators, he was like, are you sure, Dominus, you know, uh, body, body artist is dominant, you know, uh, he's his master. He said, are you sure, master, are you sure, Dominus, that we should go ahead? He said, grab a hold of your cock. We are committed. That's a man. A man is committed to action when his testosterone level is at the right place. He's strong. He's powerful. His voice is deep. You know, he's hairy. He's smelly. You know, <laughs> he's tough, you know. But I started seeing decrease in my testosterone level as I'm getting older, you know, late 30s and, and, and 40s, you know, although I've never really done any, you know, steroids or anything like that. But people, you know, like in the bodybuilding uh, uh, um, community, testosterone is king. So anything you, you know, uh, you're taking, you know, uh, to, to get big in the bodybuilding, you know, professional bodybuilding, you have to have a base and that base has to be testosterone. Well, this thing here, Boron, provides free testosterone, not only for men, but also female need, needs, you know, uh, uh, testosterone also. Because the only difference is a man or male needs more testosterone than a female. You see what I'm saying? So this thing is natural. It's a, it's free testosterone that 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 increase your strength, increase your 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 your, uh, your your explosion in the gym, increase your performance in the bedroom, increase basically anything that you a, a man needs. You know, uh, uh, he needs testosterone as his base. You understand? To increase and to to make his testicles larger and bigger. You know, to to increase that. So to increase testosterone. So this is what this thing does. It increases your testosterone level. You need to buy this. I'm not saying buy this brand. You know, but find it. Boron, B O R O N. Do your own research. You know, I will post a link on the bottom of my, you know, uh, this video, so you can go ahead and and look at the research and, and and you know, but try to keep it at a lower. You know, they said about six uh, uh, milligram uh, should be enough. You know, uh, six milligram a day, which is really a tiny. It's about 25 cents a day to make you more manly. Okay, this is Coach David Halal. Uh, hopefully soon, I'll uh, be able to shoot a video at. Uh, you know, uh, me doing kickboxing and, and, and jumping, you know, uh, uh, above stuff and breaking stuff and tearing up the gym because I'm manly, baby. I'll talk to you soon. Don't forget to subscribe, like my videos, and I'll see you later. Boron will turn you into a champ. Not a moron, not a boring man in the bedroom. I'll see you later. Bye-bye.